Good evening everyone, tonight, we will be focusing on the classic work of Rudyard Kipling, The Jungle Book. We will explore the themes and characters in the text, as well as Kipling's writing style and general influence. We will see what makes it a timeless and beloved piece of literature. Let's begin. Kipling's timeless classic The Jungle Book has been cherished by generations. Its captivating portrayal of the jungle and its fascinating characters has made it a global phenomenon. With timeless themes that appeal to readers of all ages, Kipling crafts an exciting and thought-provoking story that is sure to enthrall us as we explore it further. No doubt, it will leave us with a deeper appreciation of its legacy. Exploring Rudyard Kipling's classic work, The Jungle Book, is on the agenda. Born in India in 1865, Kipling moved to England for his education. He is especially celebrated for his works of fiction, such as The Jungle Book, Kim, and Just the Stories. Kipling's writing often entailed his experiences in India, as well as his fascination with imperialism and colonialism. In 1907, Kipling was the first English-language writer to receive the Nobel Prize for Literature in acknowledgement of his extraordinary effort to literature. Rudyard Kipling's The Jungle Book is an iconic work that has captivated generations of readers. Exploring the relationship between humans and animals, and identity and power, it follows the adventures of Mowgli in the jungles of India. Facing myriad challenges and dangers, Mowgli must rely on the help of his animal friends to survive in the wild. Ultimately, Mowgli must make the decision to either stay in the jungle or return to the human world. Mowgli, the protagonist of the Jungle Book, is a young child raised by wolves in the jungle. His story is one of self-discovery and growth, and he embarks on a journey to explore the complexity of his surroundings and the characters that inhabit it. As he faces different challenges and obstacles, he learns to become independent and self-reliant. He also develops important life lessons about trust, loyalty and the importance of family, with the assistance of his animal companions, such as Baloo the Bear and Bagheera the Panther. Rudyard Kipling's The Jungle Book created a compelling character just as genuine as the humans and animals in it. The jungle is not just a backdrop but a key part of the story, a friend, teacher, and also a foe. Its influence and symbolism can be felt throughout the work. The Jungle Book set a high bar for literature with its vivid descriptions of the wild and its examination of the precarious balance between freedom and danger. The Jungle in the Jungle Book is much more than a scenic view, it is a force of its own, one of beauty and menace to contrast the world of humans. The wild animals of the jungle have their own laws and Mowgli has to learn them to stay alive. The Jungle Book examines this delicate equilibrium with great precision, captivating readers for generations to come. The animal characters in Rudyard Kipling's The Jungle Book are an integral part of the story and its themes. Bagheera, the wise and protective panther, and Ka, the cunning and sneaky snake are just two examples of the unique personalities represented. The most beloved of these characters is Baloo, the fun-loving bear and eventual teacher and friend of Mowgli. Baloo teaches Mowgli the importance of living in the moment and enjoying life, helping him to navigate the challenges of the jungle and discover his true identity. The story of the Jungle Book illustrates the intricate bond between self-identity, family, and collective. Mowgli's trek across the jungle symbolizes his challenges to discover his true identity and status in the community. His interactions with the other characters emphasize the significance of family and how people have to collaborate in order to survive in the given environment. This renowned work of literature serves as a reminder to respect one's individuality, family, and community. Rudyard Kipling's The Jungle Book examines the influence of family in shaping our lives. Mowgli's struggles to fit in between the human world and the jungle represent the struggle between familial bonds of blood and bonds of choice. 
In the story, we witness the strong connection and loyalty of Mowgli's wolf family, as well as the meaningful relationships formed beyond blood with characters such as Baloo, Bagheera, and Ka. Through this classic work, we can appreciate the impact of both the family we are born with and the family we create ourselves. In Rudyard Kipling's classic work, The Jungle Book, nature plays an important role throughout. From the lush greenery of the jungle to the fierce storms that rage through its canopy, nature is a constant presence and a powerful force that shapes the lives of its characters in profound ways. For Mowgli, the protagonist of the book, nature is both friend and foe. He learns to use its resources in order to survive and navigates its many dangers, but also faces challenges and setbacks along the way. Through Mowgli's journey, we come to understand the power of nature to shape and transform us, both physically and emotionally. It's a reminder of our connection to something greater and our ability to have a profound impact on the world around us. Reading the Jungle Book is an incredible journey of self-discovery and exploration of timeless and universal concepts. Its themes have had a significant impact on popular culture and continue to be influential and inspiring today. Delving into the classic gives the reader a deeper understanding and appreciation of its relevance to our society today. There is no doubt that its story and protagonist will leave a lasting impression on the journey of growth and discovery. The Jungle Book delves into the significance of community, autonomy, and self-sufficiency through its characters and tales. Kipling underscores the worth of each person's strength in augmenting the general power of the group. He further accentuates the worth of independence, freedom, and personal freedom and how these values design our individuality. When combined, these themes give us a perception into Kipling's own opinion and convictions. Kipling's classic work, The Jungle Book, is an analysis of colonialism and its effects on society. Following the narrative of Mowgli, a feral child who is able to live and develop successfully in the jungle without the aid of imperialists, it confronts the belief of British grandeur over native people. The tale provides a thought-provoking contemplation of the problems of civilizing a treacherous and uncontrollable environment, exemplifying how the beliefs of the colonizers were not always shared by the natives living in the colonies. Rudyard Kipling's The Jungle Book offers an interesting look into a world formed by British colonialism. Taking place in India, then a British colony, the book follows English characters that aid in depicting the people, and even wild animals, of the area through a colonial point of view. For instance, the wolf pack which raises Mowgli is judged as more advanced due to their adoption of certain human culture aspects like language and laws. Additionally, Mowgli himself is depicted as a white boy raised by wolves, a notion that may have made British readers feel a sense of Western superiority. More profoundly, Kipling's own heritage with India could have had a part in his portrayal of the colonial world. Without greetings and without beginning with today. This classic work, The Jungle Book, by Rudyard Kipling, has delighted generations of readers since its first publication. However, it has also faced criticism around its portrayal of certain characters and themes. Allegations have been made that the book perpetuates harmful stereotypes about people of color and contributes to a culture of discrimination and prejudice. In addition to issues of race, there have been claims of cultural appropriation, with some arguing that Kipling's use of Indian culture and mythology is insensitive and disrespectful. Consequently, it is clear that there are a number of complex issues raised by this work which need to be addressed.